into Venus's orbit, just imperceptibly. In the Sun frame, the spacecraft and planet exchange momentum through their mutual gravity, equal and opposite impulses over the course of the flyby. Take a 600-kilogram spacecraft and a 3-kilometer-per-second heliocentric speed change. That's about 2 million kilogram meters per second of momentum shifted. Spread that over Venus's 5 million billion billion kilograms, and Venus's speed changes by roughly 4 times 10 to the minus 19 meters per second. Real, but hopeless to measure. People compare gravity assists to an elastic collision with a moving truck, and that's useful in one specific way. A small object can gain or lose speed by trading momentum with a massive moving object. Literally, though, nothing collides, and the spacecraft follows a curved path in Venus's gravitational field, and the planet follows an even tinier curved path in the spacecraft's field. Step back, the free energy is not free. It's borrowed from the planet's orbital motion. Venus slows Parker by taking a little of its orbital energy during each gravity assist flyby. The payoff is human scale. Our full video explaining this was posted recently. Check it out on our channel profile now.